there's a certain uh, issue that happened in Puerto Rican pro wrestling. Uh, and I'm talking about Bruce Brody's death. You know, besides what happened backstage and, you know, the Kurt make his decision and everything. But do you think Brody's passing directly affected the industry in Puerto Rico economically? Oh, yeah, it did. Because <clears throat> I had left years earlier. It happened in 1988. And I had left like in 1980, 1981. And I made occasional you know, appearances there, but not much. And business was still pretty good. But I think after Brody's death, I think a lot of American wrestlers, they were, people like to say they boycotted, they boycotted the island. I don't think they boycotted it as much as we're afraid to go there. Because if something like that could happen to Brody in the dressing room, I mean, I think everybody feared that Something could happen to them. So I think uh, it was they didn't go to Puerto Rico because one thing they were afraid. And the second thing is they they just didn't want to go because of what happened to Brody. Yeah, it affected the island quite a bit.